We've got a open car door. Uh, looks like a jeep of some kind. SUV. Didn't think I'd be able to drive it. Oh, cool. I could get on top of vehicles, though, if I have to. But they're all surrounded me. Ah! <laughs> Make a final stand if I had to. I'm just doing it because I'm sure there's an achievement that's tied to it. <laughs> You've broken so this many uh, windows, car windows. We're glad you're here. <laughs> of course you are. Welcome to the Union! Alright, I don't need to be told when to sprint. Sorry. Gotta be something up here. Nope, just more invisible walls. <laughs> Well, I'm sure there's collectibles I'm missing. But that's not generally the point of these playthroughs. Unless you guys want to walk through, I can uh, I can provide that if, uh, if you'd like. Oh boy. Oh, that's a lot. So we're gonna turn off the light now. Okay. Mobius members. Some of them are still alive then. Damn. But those things are everywhere. Oh, geez. She need to get in there and squeeze that guy for info. Stealth and sneak kills. Okay. I can sneak kill, just like the last one. F. Attack unaware enemies from behind with a sneak kill. Oh, I'm not falling for that. Nah, yeah, not not risking it. There's too many guys over there. So O'Neal was a bit of a chicken shit there. Just kind of let his <laughs> the guy that saved his life just let him die. Why well, didn't let him die? left him to die is what I should say. But I guess that was that guy's job though so can't really blame him for that if he's just a... From what I remember O'Neill is just a tech. I guess I'll just keep collecting these herbs. Aha! See here's a bottle. I bet I could toss it. Yep. Distraction! This guy's busy chowing down. I might just be able to stabby stab. Oh, nice. He brings it out before the. <laughs> awesome. He's got. They all got goo, usually. Sit in wheelchairs and safe houses and other locations to earn skills. Okay. Uh, see, if I wanted that that gunpowder, I'm going to have to break the window, but I'm sure that's going to make noise, so we're going to kill this guy first. Looks like he's too busy pounding on the door, though, so this ought to be relatively easy. 
I think that was just a bottle over there, so I don't I don't need to. <laughs> oh man! Great animation on the stealth kills. I want that gunpowder first. <laughs> So we're going to see what happens when I break a window. I think I'm far enough away from everybody else, though. Okay, good. It didn't have an alarm. <laughs> I was worried about that. Alright, we'll just leave everybody to chow down out of here, then. Oh, I could carry more than one bottle. I see. Last game, you can only use them one at a time, and they had to be in your hand. I think that's how it went. Shit. Locked, of course. Oh, okay, I'm gonna break it down. Oh, fuck. Oh, jeez, where'd they come from? <laughs> Uh, the, the good old bookshelf in front of the door trick. Thank you, Resident Evil right. 4. Hopefully that'll hold. Probably won't. Anything I can use? Oh. Yeah, there we go. Another filthy bathroom. Oh, here's a here's a first aid thing here. Okay, I got two syringes now. That's good. O'Neill. That was probably him, if I had to guess. <laughs> Any closer? Okay, calm down. Don't shoot. I'm not gonna hurt you. See? You can lower your gun. I'm on your side. You're not Mobius. You might not be one of those things, but that doesn't mean you're on my side. You're right. I don't work for Mobius, but I was sent here by them. Have you seen what those things out there? What they can do? Yeah, I have. Lucky for you, your partner was willing to sacrifice himself so you could escape. He wasn't my partner. He was just a member of Union Security Detail. Protecting me was his job. And my job is to solve a hardware issue. Dying inside here is above my pay grade. I'm not a soldier. I'm just a technician. I know. Stop! Or I'll shoot! <coughs> Ow! A soldier would have taken the safety Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I told you. We're on the same side. Let's try this again. I'm Sebastian Castellanos. I'm O'Neill. Liam O'Neill. So you're not Mobius, but they sent you in here? Why? I'm looking for my... I'm trying to restore the core, just like you are. Yeah? Good luck with that. I'm done. I'm just gonna hold out here until extraction. They can't extract you. Not until Lily is found. Who's Lily? Look, everyone is stuck in here until the core is located. Can you help me out? If you're asking me to go out there with you, you can forget about it. This is a safe house, so I'm staying safe. Got me? But I may have a lead on the core. I detected some signals nearby that resonated the core's frequency. We were trying to track them when we got attacked. Here, listen to this. 
It sounds like a little girl, right? Quiet. Was that her? The car? I think so. But I've been picking up all sorts of weird signals on my communicator since we got here. No way to know for sure until you track it to its source. How do I do that? Your communicator can pick it up too. Once you're out there, check it. You'll see. You'll probably pick up other signals while you're out there. It wouldn't hurt to follow them to find out what- No way. The core first. It's the only way we're getting out of here. Suit yourself. Let's pair up our communicators. That way I can tell you if I find anything. Yeah, okay. Can't hurt, I guess. <laughs> Can't hurt. Chapter 3, Resonances. Oh, okay, so we got a... We got uh, conversation options here. So you've been stuck in here a week already? Has it been that long? Damn. The time's a little fluid in here. It's a week, This was okay. supposed to be a simple in and out job. Like, home in time for dinner simple. But this is different than anything I've ever seen before. What do you mean? Wonky stuff usually happens when a core goes AWOL, but... What's happening is more than that. This place is falling apart at the seams. We use the stable field emitter, but it's not working like it's supposed to. What's the stable field emitter? If Mobius sent you in here, shouldn't you know this stuff already? I probably should, <laughs> but they sent me in. <laughs> there were five members of your team? There was a security force already in here to help us, but yeah, there are five search team members. W wait, did you just say were? I found Baker. He's dead. Huh. Doesn't surprise me. He locked onto a powerful signal and went to investigate. I told him we should just request extraction and report our findings, leave the dangerous work to somebody else. But he wouldn't hear of it, being team leader and all. Always had to be the brave one. You ask me, there's a thin line between brave and foolish. Yeah. There's a thin line between prudent and cowardly, too. Oh. Tomato, tomato. I'm not saying I'm glad he's dead. <laughs> what kind of asshole do you think I am? <laughs> I hope the others are okay. Pretty. I'll let you know if I find anybody else. You'd really do that? Thanks. I'd appreciate you don't that. Don't uh, too broken up about it being dead. <laughs> but uh, it's more dangerous out there than I expected. Any idea where I can get some weapons and supplies? I tried to tell you about this one signal, but you didn't want to hear oh, it. Oh God. Well, I'm all ears now. <laughs> I picked something up from two Mobius security team members who were talking about weapons caches. Maybe you can follow it and get some gear. Maybe they're out there, can help you out. Now think about it. Come on, man. I'm all alone in here. I could use some protection. Maybe if you hadn't let your last guard take the fall for you. Whatever. <laughs> I'll mark the signal on your communicator. Follow it or don't follow it. I don't care. <laughs> Those things are pretty tough. It takes a lot of ammo to get them off my back. Do you have anything stronger in here? Not in here, but you could probably find some out there. This place was designed to be peaceful, but Mobius and firepower go hand in hand. Do you know where I can find some of this firepower? It's pretty chaotic out there. You're not going to find a pile of heavy-duty weapons altogether. But I did see something useful next to an abandoned APC just outside. I'll mark its location for you. But be careful. There are a lot of those things hanging around it. Okay. So you've been stuck in here a week. Has okay, this yeah, this is all. In time, but what do you mean? Wonky. What's ha we use? What's the Mobius? <laughs> He's a passive-aggressive little punk. <laughs> but you didn't want to hear about it. Right. <laughs> I just wanted to just punch him in the face right there and there. Oh well. Well, okay, we found a team member at least. Here we go. Workbenches can can be used to craft ammunition and items with components. Okay. Coffee makers. Drinking coffee at a coffee maker will restore you to full health. Really? Coffee makers will automatically begin brewing another pot after use, but the process will take some time, so okay. So if I use it now, then it'll take a little while before it recharges. Tell me. I see. So, I, as I find more team members, I could probably talk to them, too. So this is kind of a hub, almost. I should probably just keep overriding these files. It doesn't... It doesn't matter, really. <laughs> so, Neil's kind of a prick. 
But I guess he knows what he's doing, so I guess that's a good thing. I shouldn't say prick, he's selfish, I guess, is the thing. Uh, looks like we got a mirror. What the? Who is that? That looked an awful lot like a nurse. And there's that familiar little tune. Okay, okay. Let's see what I can craft first. Uh, the animations. Oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah. Weapon upgrade. Okay, so I can make syringes and handgun bullets. Okay, so I just need one one ingredient, it looks like. Well, I got 22 times the gunpowder. Oh, here we go. I guess I'll just make as much as I can for right now. Might as well. Oh, okay, it stops after a certain point. So I can make 11 rounds. Might as well. DIY <laughs> achievement unlocked. <laughs> awesome. I am a DIY kind of guy. Okay, so I can definitely make medical syringes too. I might as well make one. Cost three herbs, and I had three herbs, so there we go. And I assume I can upgrade my storage capacity too. Here we go, I got 30 weapon parts, so... What should we upgrade? Probably ammo capacity, right? This firepower isn't necessarily useful at this point. It takes 20. Oh, I upped it by one, okay. Okay, well, can I do anything with 10 weapon parts? Probably not. 30, 20, 90. Okay, yeah, no, there, I ain't doing anything else with the weapon parts. Field crafting. Use the, select the field crafting icon from the arsenal menu to craft items without using a workbench. Field crafting consumes more resources. Okay. So basically you want to keep coming back here as often as you can, but if you had to craft something in the field, it's going to cost you more resources than it usually would. Okay. That So they kind of built in a penalty to... User communicator. I should probably... Oh, cool. There's a little spray paint marker there for safe houses, probably. I'm pretty sure that was the nurse. So let's see what happens here. Oh, okay. I'm on the outside of the office now. So... Oh, I hear the cat. <laughs> Yeah, she's in there. Okay. Oh, okay. So that's what they're talking about, wheelchairs. Oh, there's a workbench in here, too. Okay. Can I open this door? <laughs> okay. 
Anything behind here? Nope. <laughs> We're back to checking behind the upgrade chair. Let me out of here! Detective Castellanos, what a pleasant surprise. Welcome back. You again? How are you here? I could ask you the same question. Regardless, it's nice to see a familiar face. Even if that face has seen far too much. You look tired, Detective. I can help you get back in shape. Just like before. Of course. Upgrades. Okay. Alright, we got 1400 points we can use, so let's see here. I guess recovery would be the thing, or maybe health. Oh, okay. I can't even do it. I can't even do it. It's fifteen hundred for the first one. Jeez. All right. What about recovery? Uh, uh. Here we go. No, it's still stealth would be good, probably. So I can upgrade steady hands. Might as well. I did notice that my. My sway was a little wonky. I don't understand. This place. You, it's just like Beacon. But this isn't Beacon. This is Union. Is it? It all seems familiar to me. These walls, that chair, you. For me, it's as if nothing has changed at all. Don't okay, so they're just not going to answer that question. The task at hand. How am I ever going to get these nails right if you keep interrupting my manicure? Okay, okay. I know my office is relaxing, but it's no place to loiter. How am I ever going to get these nails? Okay, it's going to cycle through a bunch of different ones. We got lockers on the side, so it's like they. They kind of streamlined that, too. Everything... That used to be an entire hub in the first game. Now it's just a place you go to sit and chat with the nurse and upgrade your skills. Okay. Door's open now. Good. And now I can get back. What's up, Kitty? Anything new? Let's take a look around. I wonder if the uh, the office upgrades every time I come back here. Oh, it's crossed out now. Yeah. Being the tip of the knife is a dangerous job. Yep. So Baker's gone. I found Liam. Anything else? Read 1998. I can't read some of this stuff. <laughs> it's like raining outside. It's funny. I should be able to wear the trench coat. Oh well. <laughs> you have any more goo for me, buddy? I don't have another slide, so I can't really check it out. I think it's just the one, but I'll check. I don't remember picking up one anyway. Yeah. All empty. Okay.
Still don't know what happened with my third partner from the first game. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't even know if they'll mention him again. Kind of wondering about that. I think his name was... I think it was Lewis? I can't remember. I don't think so. But Lewis sticks out to me. Anyway, let's continue on. <laughs>